Hey guys, so I wanted to get on here quickly to share some important details in regards to Apple's latest rollout in security patches. iOS 16.4.1 security response is now available for iPhone, iPad, and the Mac. And I wanted to share the details with you guys, how to install it, how to make sure it is installed on your iPhone, and why it is extremely important for you to have this installed onto your device as soon as possible. So let's just dive right into this video. Now, as always, if you would like to stay up to date with the latest iOS news and Apple software updates, of course, don't forget to subscribe and make sure you turn on those notifications so that you don't miss another episode. Now, the first thing I would like to talk about is what is a rapid security response update? Well, this is basically a security patch that's provided in between software updates in order to patch any security issues or flaws within your iPhone, your iPad, and your Mac without Apple having to send an entire software update for your device. So a security response is something we've been doing on computers for years. It is now brought over to the iPhone. I talked about this before, but those were sent only over to beta software. This one is a 16.4.1 and I want to start off with that because it is only available for those devices running official software so if you're running a beta you won't see this on your iPhone and the way you find out is you want to go into settings you want to go into general and then you want to go into software updates now if you see the latest security response available here then of course you want to click to install it's going to be a small file anywhere from 70 to 95 to 100 megabytes now if you don't see it here it could be because your iPhone has already installed it you want to go into automatic updates here and if this toggle here for security response is turned on there's a good possibility that your iPhone has already installed this security response as Apple continues to roll it out it's been about 24 hours since they released it it could take up to 48 hours for everyone to get it now in order for you to know if you already have your iOS security response on your iPhone your iPad or your Mac the thing you need to do is go into settings here go into general, go into about, and right here where it says iOS version, you wanna click into that, and right below here, if you see this right here, remove security response for iOS 16.4.1a, then that means it's already installed. You don't want to remove it, obviously, just make sure that it is there, and if it is, the latest security patches are now put in place on your iPhone, your iPad, and your Mac. There's over 13 security issues being covered here with the latest iOS 16.4.1 security response, and it's also available for the Mac, as I mentioned, Mac OS 13.3.1 and iPad OS 16.4.1 also has the latest security response. This is extremely important. Again, guys, it is covering over 13 security flaws and issues within iOS and Mac OS operating systems. So there you guys have it. I thought this information was extremely important for you guys to know about. Again, only available for official software. Make sure it is already installed on your iPhone. And if it isn't, make sure you go into software updates and install the latest rapid secure response available from Apple. Thank you for watching this quick one, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.